All right. Do you also have Chrome extensions on, you know, several devices? Most likely you're like me. You've got a desktop computer like I'm using. Maybe you've got a Chromebook, a different laptop, or you've got a couple laptops, whatever it is. It can be a pain if you've got a ton of uh, extensions that maybe some of them are using a lot of resources and or you just don't use them on different devices and you want to keep things kind of light or just cleaned up. As you can tell over here, I've got a lot of extensions installed and those are only the ones that are pinned. And for me, what I wanted to do was to clean things up so that on my Chromebook, I don't have all of these extensions loading, you know, trying to do, take my attention, blah, blah, blah. So that's what I'm gonna cover with you today is how I solve that issue. Um, and real quick, before we get into that, if you're not familiar, I'm Adam with Productivity Academy. I'm covering up my own face with a quick video here, uh, but let's just get into it. This is going to be pretty short, uh, but it is important. There's a couple things that you need to know about how this works. So let me go ahead and uh, get rid of the floating head there. Let's go in. The, where you're gonna wanna go is if you're in Chrome, you're gonna wanna go in and go into settings. And then if you're not sure where to go, it's right here at the top, but you can type in sync and you will see that click there and then you want to manage what you sync okay and normally when you come in it'll be set to sync everything okay but what you want to do is click on customize sync and you probably still see it here like this uh and depending on what you want to do apps or extensions but extensions is really what we're after and what i'm talking about depending on what else you want to do you can also customize that but today we're just focusing on extensions Okay, now what this means is you can't just go and uh, as of right now, at least, uh, you can't uninstall uh, extensions, but what you can do is come in and manage extensions and turn them on and off. Okay, so instead of removing, you could turn, for example, let's say I don't want ClickUp on the Chromebook, to, or rather I don't want it here, then I could turn that off and it doesn't remove it, but now it won't be loading. And then on the Chromebook, it'll still show up and be in the extensions bar up here. So I'm gonna turn that back on. That's a really important part because the way it's it's um, it makes it sound, it's like, oh, well, if it's not syncing them across, then I should just be able to totally remove that from Chrome. However, if you do that, it will remove it from all devices. It was what I found in my testing. So have to make sure that you're only turning it off and on, and then that will selectively sync uh, or rather not sync across devices. Just don't remove unless you want it removed from all devices. So hopefully this is uh, helpful for you. This is definitely something I was looking for and uh, wanted to share that with you. If you have any comments or questions, uh, just leave a comment and I will get back to you.